Welcome back to Crafty Nanny. Today, it's all about the plants. Let's turn the page to see what happens. Today's story is Patch, Hedgy, and Scoot's Botanical Alphabet by Anushka R. Merrill. I wish I could make summer last longer, said Hedgy as she looked out the window. My friend Lena can do that. She's a scientist, said Mom. What kind of scientist makes summer? asked Hedgy. Well, she's a botanist, so she studies plants and keeps them in a greenhouse. So her house is green? asked Hedgy. Not exactly, said Mom. Why don't we pay her a visit? It was cold when Hedgy and Mom stepped outside for their walk to Lena's house. It was now autumn on the edge of the woods. Hedgy wondered how it could possibly be summer anywhere within 20 minutes of their house. Mom reassured her that she was in for a real surprise. And surprised she was. Hedgy was shocked. The plants in Lena's greenhouse were as vibrant as they were in spring. There was even a pond. Wow, it's a different world in here, exclaimed Hedgy. Yes, it's a very precisely controlled system, explained Lena. We keep it warm in here all year long so we can study the plants. And boy, are there many to study. I bet you have one for every letter of the alphabet, Hedgy said. Just about, chuckled Lena. Right here we have L for lotus lilies and M for the bright red monarda over there. Let's see how many more letters we can find. Hedgy, Mom, and Lena walked around the greenhouse learning more about what it was like to be a botanist while trying to find flowers that matched each letter of the alphabet. For A, they found Aster. B belonged to Bouvardia, a plant that Hedgy had never heard of before. C was for calla lilies. She actually knew those because Mom had bought them only a few weeks ago. For the letter D, they found Dianthus. I don't see anything for letters E or F, said Hedgy. Well, we're still stocking up on plants, explained Lena. I'm sure we'll have something for those letters soon. In Lena's greenhouse, G was for Gerbera daisies and Holly represented the letter H. Hedgy couldn't believe that there were so many different flowers and that Lena knew the names to all of them. I'll tell you what, said Lena. Why don't you come around the greenhouse anytime you want and I can teach you more about plants? She loved seeing how excited Hedgy was about learning. Deal, said Hedgy, and she and Mom said their goodbyes and headed back into the cool autumn air. As they walked home again, Hedgy couldn't stop talking about the plants she had seen and tried to find more plant names to complete her botanical alphabet. But with 18 more letters to go, I think she will need your help. The end. I absolutely love plants and learning about new flowers. Come back on Friday to make a bouquet that's ready for fall and also flowers that last all year long. Keep crafting and I'll see you next time.